Right, what about rocks and stuff, though? Surely that if we can learn how to pick a rock up and sm- Oh, there we go. Wait. Yes! Inspect it! Surely that's going to be for a tool. It is! Nice! So we can smash the living bejesus out of things now with that rock. Yeah, there you go! Look at him! Did you see that? Let me inspect it again, see if he does anything. Did he just lick the rock? <laughs> it's not food. Alright, let's drop that. Stick. Oh, it's so much clearer now. Now I understand, like, what to look for around. At first, I was like, oh my god, it's so overwhelming. <laughs> now it's like, okay, take your time, look around, see what there is to use, and just get all that brain juice, all the knowledge you can. Dead branch. Can I not use this as a smacking stick or something? Right, inspect it again. I want to see if he does anything different this time. He loves licking stuff. You like that? And drop. All right. Who are you? We can analyze them. I remember that. Analyze. That's an elder and it's La. Okay. Is this another elder? Who are you? Ban. <laughs> okay. Uh, grab. Oh, these are like the little uh, things that I was eating when I was outside in, in the danger area. Uh, the berries. I think they stopped the... No, the bleeding was like the fiber thing. This just might be straight up food. Yeah, there you go. So this is the tarmy berry. Okay, eat. Oh, is that good? Rubbing it out. Nice. Get some more. Wait, what's that one? Oh, wait, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. That looked like it was off. Inspect it. Oh, wait. I don't know why he just did that. I, I'm not going to trust that one. That's like, that doesn't look as ripe as the other stuff. Let's grab this. And then eat that one. Oh, that looks good. And then this one. Whoa! I didn't do that. What is it? <laughs> it's nothing good, right? Oh, wait. African agaric fungus. Eat. Okay, so that does really mess up my stomach. Becoming omnivorous. Your lineage can't assimilate nutrients from the mushrooms kind of food. Improve your resistance against injuries and poisons. Okay, become omnivorous through neural development. I don't think I want to. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do that. I'm going to drink a load of water to try and fix my uh, my stomach. And that should help, right? I'll start lowering the, uh, the issue that we're having. There we go. So now the rest of them see me doing that. If they eat that mushroom, I wonder if they will do the same. If that is a thing where they just kind of copy me based on what I'm learning, that's such a cool little thing to have. Look, they're all just having a little drink. Adult female coupled with ooh. <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, so she's called App and she's coupled with ooh. I think that's the uh, the baby that I brought back. Oh, it might have been that one there. Who are you? Let's analyze. That's ooh! Coupled with the app. Okay. Oh, they got babies too. I think that these are their uh, their little babies that are running around. Also, I kept calling them monkeys. A few people were like, they're not monkeys. They're apes. Okay. <laughs> I mean, you guys know what I meant. I think the correct actual term is hominids or hominoids. Oh, God. I've said it now. I'm probably wrong with that. But, yeah. <laughs> it always amazes me when people get really upset about stuff like that. Can we, uh, can we groom? I'm going to pick all the, the horrible flies off your back. Make your coat look amazing. There we go. Just getting rid of all that stuff. Yep. Just hold on a second. You're going to look beautiful in no time. <laughs> it's so weird. I mean, obviously, you do see this. The animal kingdom. The grooming is uh, or grooming is a huge part to their day when they just sit up in the trees, you know, make sure their, uh, their fur is nice and clean. Giving each other uh, baths and stuff. Bonding. There we go. Oh, there we go. I just ate the flies as well. Matured neuron. Nice. So, Q, you hang on there. I'll be back. I'll bring you some uh, some good food. Right. I think it's time to start heading out for adventure. Is there an objective? Build a sleep spot. We did that, didn't we? Oh, look at that. 
Some items can lead to construction. Possibilities when in a stockpile, depending on their number. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So, so actually picking this up and then placing that on there like that. Look at that. Add to pile. I didn't see that before. And I, th I think I'm making a bed. So, grab. Add to pile. Start construction. No way did I just make a bed. Build. Look at me go! What's he doing? He's smacking. Oh, <laughs> nice! Various construction can improve your settlement. Evolution. Wait. So, what's this? Form a couple. I think I can do that because Q is just behind me over there. What is this? Okay. Neural help. Assign neural energy to connect neurons and develop your lineage's capacities. Grow the neurons you want and mature enough to receive energy. Neural energy is accumulated by doing actions when kids are around. So they'll learn based off what we're doing. They'll pick up on that. Whoa, evolutionary leap. So we get to see how far ahead we've gone. <gasps> Change the generation. Matured neurons. So these are the ones that we've currently got then. Neuronal growth is complete. Assign neural energy to initiate a new communication skill. Using the senses generates a growth potential as long as they are further used in different contexts. I think I'm going to go for this one. The ability to gather all clan members is acquired. Hold B to gather all clan members and have them follow you. No way! So you can move them to different settlements as well? So if this one gets a little bit like... What would you say? I don't know if there's like changing seasons or anything. I don't think in this environment I should really worry about that, but... If we need to get our clan and then move out, maybe there's a danger coming. Maybe there's a predator or something that's too close by. I love that. So that's opened up two more possibilities then because we've bro opened up that neural network. Communication skill can be specialized in certain contexts. Okay, so we got to get that by, I guess, following that train. God, this is so detailed. I didn't think it had anything like this. We can still do this one as well. Let's go ahead and do that. Motor skill. The ability to switch hands with an item is acquired. Oh, okay. That could be good. So maybe we can like... <laughs> can we dual equip? <laughs> Some sticks or something? Okay, so they all answer back. Clan call is hold B. Intelligence sense is right. Let's just try this one then. So that gives me all different kinds. So we can stand up. Let's just slowly walk around... Oh, that's so reminiscent of Caesar. Wait, wait, let me clear the hood. Stand up. Look at him. Oh, he's so... We're so advanced. Let's focus on that. So that's going to be the horse tail, right? Oh, there we go. That's why I was wondering about how to actually show what we're looking for. So that would have been so much easier last time when I had all those injuries. <laughs> right, so... Oh, look at him. Stood up now. Whoa, why are you stood up for so long? You don't do... Have we evolved into Caesar? Oh, I don't even care. If we're like really early on, I I'm still calling us Caesar right now. 100%. Right, so I still want to use my senses. And I want to try and focus in on stuff like this. What are you? That's the stuff we already know what that is. Horse tail. I think I may have to go venturing out a little bit more now. Oh, wait, no. Stuff over there. Look at him. Focus in on that. Identify. Okay, so that's a clan member. So I'm smelling my clan members as well. That sounds weird, but it's fine. You guys know what I mean. Right, I guess then form a couple. Uh, no way. Hugh, have you found a different boyfriend? Partnering with Lutz? What? Why? Oh, no. Oh, you know what? I think I'm going to have to find myself a new girlfriend. Yeah, Kiyu is... Uh, she's obsessed with Lutz, and I can't really uh, break up a happy home like that, so... I'm just going to let them be happy. I'm going to go this way, though. I know when we were adventuring around last time... Who are you? Oh, that's Ooh. <laughs> Sorry, Ooh, you just sat there on your own. I remember when we were venturing around last time, we saw some uh, 
clan members that needed a help. So maybe we can help them with that this time. I don't even know if I've said it yet, guys, but welcome back to Ancestors. I'm sorry, I'm getting, like, really caught up in this stuff. It's so much fun. And it seems like you guys really enjoyed it, too, because the love on the previous episode was insane. I think as of right now, it's, like, closing in on 20,000 likes, which is just insane. So thank you so much for all the love and uh, all the helpful tips as well, because this isn't as straightforward as I thought it was going to be. There's a lot more to it, but I love that. So... What we're going to do is we're going to use our senses and let's focus in on some stuff. What are we dealing with? Okay, that's a question mark. We don't know what that is. What's that down there? We don't know what that is too. Memorize it. Right, let's see if we can go over to that and work out what everything is around this area. I'm pretty sure that I know what things are going to be because we spent a lot of time around here. One of the, uh, the heads up that I got from a lot of people was to stick around. Whoa! Oh, okay. One of the things that I was told by you guys was to basically use the trees a lot, which I am absolutely happy doing. Are we going to get a coconut here? Okay, emotions and dopamine. Yeah, we know about all that. Yeah, there we go. We got some coconuts or something. So grab that. Oh, <gasps> a new food source. I'm going to have to, yeah, I'm going to have to stick to the trees. That's a good idea. The predators are going to be using the ground and stuff, right? So... Oh, I thought I just heard, like, a hissing sound. Trying to be really careful. Climb on there. I love the fact that it keeps hold of stuff as well. So we can just, like, sit up here and have a look at what we've just found. <laughs> it's so simple, but it's so cool. Inspect it. What we got? Okay, he's a little bit shocked. New food. Okay, so here's the thing, though. Cocos. Do we have to switch hands? Altering and crafting. Once then left hand, some items may be altered with bare hands or crafted. Alter. Wait, so I wonder if I put that in my left hand and then put the rock in my right hand, if I can smash that open. Hold LB to take position to alter or craft. What? Alter? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Are you peeling... No way. Do it. There we go. We're actually peeling it. Oh, I guess you would say peeling it. And then we're going to find the, the juicy bits inside. And then we're going to work out that this is a food. Go on, keep going. Yeah, there we go. We got it. So then you want to take that bit out. Get rid of the outer shell. Discovered new alteration. Stripping. Cocos can be modified. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa. What was that? So, now I want to inspect it again. And it should come back as a new food? New food. There we go. So, here's the next bit, though. Because now we've got the coconut. We also need to find a rock to smash this open with. Wait, can I alter it again? Is it going to do that? Yeah, no. He's... Wait. Did it do that? No. Okay, yeah. I think he's just trying to strip it with that. Oh! I've just realized. The sticks. The sticks, the sticks, the sticks. Oh, my God. There's so much going on. There's so, so much going on. <laughs> if you guys don't know what I'm thinking about yet, my brain's on, like, a, a one-way road at the moment. But the sticks. If you've seen King Kong when he grabs the, the tree... And then he uses his hands to just go, and then just get rid of, like, all the branches on it. Then maybe that's what we can do right now. So I'm just going to drop you for a second. Wait, switch the hands and then drop. Oh, is it going to roll away? Grab this. And then we'll switch hands with that. Grab. Alter. Please tell me I can smash these together. Oh, I'm a genius. Yes, do it. Smack that rock. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait. No, I'm in the wrong hand. Switch, switch hands. Yes. Do that. And then... Oh, it's about to happen. Yes. Wait. Why? Wait. You like that? Wait, but... I mean, I, I, I broke it, but... We learned how to do it. Grab... 
I'm getting so excited for stuff like this because it's literally me learning along with the uh, with the ape. I'm going to call it an ape. If it's something else, then let me know in the comments. <laughs> Switch hands and then alter. Oh, please tell me it's about to do it. Oh, no. Wait, why did that happen, though? It's okay. We're learning. We're learning. The only way we're going to get this down is by failing a bunch of times so we know not to do it the wrong way. And then switch hands. Alter. And then that. Oh, wait. Whoa! What just happened? What's happening? Oh, my God. That is the thing. Dead branches can be modified. I have a stick now. <laughs> okay, so I'll tell you guys exactly what happened there. When I was trying to alter the state of what I was doing with this stick, I basically held down the button like I did before when we were sat on there, and it broke the stick because I was way too forceful. But I was a little bit more gentle. I didn't hold it down as long, and then it just stripped the branches off of the stick. Now we got a pokey stick, I think. Switch hands. Can I attack with this? Inspect it, because you want to work, work out what this is, right? New tool. Yeah, stick. Nice. Oh, that's so good. Okay, right, we're going to go and get some rest, because it's really late, and it's probably really dangerous. Right, get up there. I am so proud that we managed to actually get all that stuff there, because what I did this time was basically slow down, and rather than just freak out about the environment that we're in and all the death and destruction that is absolutely around us, I was <laughs> trying to work out, like, what we can use to get our brain bigger. And it seems that I'm not that stupid because we're, we're doing it. Oh, wait, why is... Oh, we're cold, we're cold, we're cold. Right, come on. You guys did say, like, keeping them alive can be difficult if you're not focusing, so get over there. Come on. A memorized item has been forgotten. Okay, that's fine. And then, can we get over there? All right, we're good. We're back. We're back home. Come on, get inside. Nice and warm. Into the cave. If I leave my stick here, are you gonna... Switch hands? No. I remember there was something as well that helped us with... Oh, there we go. The cold's gone away. Whoa. What is this? What's the... What's the weird, like... Almost as if we're blinking or about to faint or something. Uh... Would you like a stick? Ooh, here you go. Have the stick. Is <laughs> he got a stick? Oh, he's so happy with his little stick! <laughs> right, we're actually going to have a drink here. I wonder if that makes anything different. Let's see. Can we actually get a drink from this? Yeah, we can. I don't think this will change anything. Just a change of scenery, I guess, but... Is that good? Yeah, that works. Right, there we go. Let's stay here for a second. I have another idea. While I was sleeping last night, I had a dream. And <laughs> I had a bit of a, a realization of what I did. So, if we switch hands and then alter. And then I want to peel this stuff off, right? There we go. So, there we go. When we feel that, like, resistance, you let go. I know you guys can't feel this, but... My, uh, my controller's vibrating when I get to there, when that happens on the screen. There we go. Remove that, and then that exposes the, uh, the actual coconut. Nice. So we've got that now. And then what I want to do here is find a rock. Because I'm thinking, with what I did with the sticks, where I was just a little bit more gentle to actually get the stick to look like it was like something you could use as a tool, maybe I can do that with a rock and just not hit it as hard. Because I obliterated it last time. I was just going hell for leather on it. <laughs> like, yes! Hit the coconut! <laughs> Maybe if I don't do that, it might work out a little bit better for me or something. I'm, th I'm hoping anyway. The one thing I will give this credit for at the moment is it really gets the juices flowing of the brain, right? <laughs> it's like, there's so much to think about. But it's so good. I've never played a game where you have to, like, really think about everything you're doing for your character. Right, so pick one of these up. Grab, and then alter. Right, wait, wait, wait. Before we do this, let's just try and stop staying on the ground, right? Can you climb with both of these in your hands? Oh my god, yes we can. And we're going to sit in the sun. There he is. And what we're going to do now is alter, and... Oh, there we go. Okay, so that's being really gentle. And whack, look at him. Whack. <laughs> Smack it. 
A bit, a bit harder. Oh. A little bit harder. Oh, wait. A granite rock can alter a coconut. <gasps> so drop the granite rock and switch. And now I want to inspect, right? Food sauce or maybe something we could... Maybe a water sauce or something. Because you want to drink the stuff inside of it. Yeah, there we go. New food. And then eat. That's got to taste good. Coconut is great. But I'm pretty sure it's a, it's a laxative. So if you, if you have too many of them, it is going to end in a bad day for you. I'm just going to keep eating that. My vitality does have a little red circle around it. I don't actually know how to fill that. Maybe just to keep eating and drinking or get a good night's rest. Oh, wow. Okay, so you actually get a lot from a coconut. Assimilated nutrients from the cotyledon? kind of food no idea what that means we did it and we've got oh look at that that's a snake buff so if i get bitten by something that has a venom the coconut will help is that a thing <laughs> i don't know if it is i don't know maybe maybe it is senses and i'm looking for something that i could potentially use as no that's more coconut right so i don't think we're going to find anything that we've already come across. So maybe like this, this stuff over there. That's what I was trying to look at before. So identify it. Oh, it's a hiding spot. So if we get in a little bit of trouble, we can do that. What's this then? So this is just the rocks. Yeah, granite rock. Okay, we know where they are. And this stuff, more granite rocks. That's the clan member over there. What's that? Memorize. I know up in one of these... Oh, there it is. That's where the, the, the clan member died that we were with as the baby at the beginning. Memorize. Yeah, let's go and take a look at what this is. Because I need to find something that's going to help that clan member over there. And I have no idea what it is. My mission today, guys, is to try and just evolve. Well, I guess not evolve is the wrong word. Learn as much as I possibly can. And then hopefully make you guys proud. And if you want to see more of this, and obviously we'll continue it. I'm at least going to give it this video. To see if you guys definitely want to see more. And then get over there. No! Get it! Oh! <gasps> it's like a thrill to that from jumping from tree to... Oh, yeah, this is the fiber. This is the fiber that helps. Grab that. Oh. Pick it up. Wait. There we go. Grab. And we want to learn what that does because that stops the bleeding. There we go. Right, so we've got that. And then a switch hands back. No way have I just done that with my big brain. Yes. <laughs> oh, lift. Lift it. Shit. Wait. Oh, wait. Did I just break it? No. Okay, right. Let's try that again. Give me the stick. I think I'll be able to find like grubs and things under there that I can use. Switch. And alter. And there we go. Right, nice. We got a stick again. And switch the hands. Lift. Yeah, no, it's just going to keep breaking the stick. So maybe I need something a bit stronger than that. Oh, so maybe it is just straight up sleep then. There we go. I don't need that anymore. And it's got to be food then to replenish the rest of it. Okay, I understand now. Because I was trying to work out why is, like, why is he so hungry all the time? There we go. So it's the need. You can kind of understand what... Oh, shit. No! No, no, no. Drink. Drink, drink, drink. Right, we're good there. Seems like we're still a little bit hungry, so I'm going to keep it going. There we go. And this way, with me eating this, if I do fall out of a tree, I'll have the uh, the added effect from that buff so I can recover quicker from any broken bones, right? It's not like it's not going to stop my legs from breaking, <laughs> especially with the height that I fall from. But it might just aid. Are they stealing all my horsetail? Okay, so I've been thinking of a way to bring the ape that's over there down to the river so it can drink and maybe cure it. Wait, shake? What? Wait, no way. <laughs> We're gonna get a coconut to fall. Nice. 
But I was thinking of ways that I could get the ape down here. When in actual fact, we worked out not long ago how to crack open a coconut. So let's give that a try. So if we go around this side, I think there should be some rocks down here. We can do that pretty quick as well because we know what we're doing now. So let's switch it to this hand and then grab a rock. Nice. Do it pretty quick. And alter. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't want to do that yet. Let's drop that and then alter this first. Let's peel this back. There you go. Expose the insides. There we go. Come on. Keep it going. It's so satisfying doing this. It really, really is. Once you get around to working out how to do it as well, you really don't forget. It's such a good way of doing it. Okay, we got the inside, and then we want to grab that. And now, we want to alter it again, and just give it a little smack. And then another little smack. And then a little, little another smack. There we go. Right. Okay, so now drop this. What about that? Oh, wait. Let's switch hands. Give. Oh! Yes, we did it! I think we did it! It might have just been any food, but we, we gave it a coconut. How's that working out? I may have just been able to just take this to them, but... Hey, maybe coconut's a bit better. <laughs> maybe they've never had... Oh, there we go! Generous leader befriending a, a poisoned outside. Oh, so it was a coconut we needed because the, the coconut cured the poison. Like we saw with the venom or the fangs, I guess. Let's eat this. That's not going to poison us, right? No. So now what we want to do is... Can we... Analyze. Codge. Female. Fertile. Wait here. Wait, can we not get you to come with us? Can I... Groom. I think if you hold it for a couple of seconds, it might strengthen the bond. No. Okay, right. I'm just going to keep doing it then. There we go. Okay, so it's when it has that glow around the screen. That's when you let go of it. So groom like that. There we go. Identify the jungle's hidden waterfall oasis. So we've got, we've got a mate now. And she's called Kodge. Okay, nice. All right, where, where are we going to head to next then? Guys, I'm so proud of it. Wait, are you coming with... No, 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 no. Kodge, wait there. It's too dangerous. Wait. Hold on a second. You wait here, okay? Right. Is it this thing over here? If we use our intelligence... Maybe that? I'm going to go see what that is. Maybe we got to stand on that branch there and understand what's going on with the waterfall. Because I think everything's happening around where we're living right now, which is the, uh, in the cave up top. Can we climb this as well? I think we should be able to. There we go. Ooh, I can climb this. Okay, here we go. Let's get to the top of that. Oh no, what was that? Can I climb this, though? I don't think I can. Oh, wait, I can climb this. Wait, what? That's got to be a skill in itself, like learning how to climb a sheer rock face. Whoa, whoa, what is that? Grab. Inspect it. Whoa! What is that? Carrying a precious stone gives courage when in fear of the unknown, less dopamine is needed. Some precious stones also help to form couples or to convince an outsider to join you. So like a little gift or something. Oh, I'm going for it. Uh, grab it, please. Oh, yes. I know I'm risking it doing that, but I want to show off in front of my new girlfriend. I've got her a stone. Here you go. I think I'm going to impress her. Can we give it? Give. Here you go. You like it? Wait, I can take it as well. Analyze. Coupled with wait, coupled with Lut. Wait, what does that mean? Oh wait, I'm Lut. Oh, oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Okay. <laughs> so I was thinking that was a different one. It's not. It's me. So I saw the uh, <laughs> the ape up there that said coupled with Lut. I was outraged, by the way. <laughs> I don't realize it might be me. Can I not change my name? 
All right, let's go and find out what it wants me to do. Let's see. It says, identify the jungle's hidden waterfall oasis. Okay. Discover. There we go. New landmark discovery. So this is our area, and this is what it's called, the hidden waterfall oasis. Oh, yeah, it said that at the beginning. This was the area where we'd be. I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty proud of what we've achieved so far. I'm not... <laughs> I mean, there's been a few sketchy moments, but I've been nowhere near as terrified as last time. I know we haven't run into anything, but we've... Oh, I may have spoke too soon. Oh no, something crashed down there. Inspect a meteorite. Okay, we have to go and do this. <gasps> jungle Master Explorer discovered the jungle's hidden waterfall. Look at that down there though. In the um in the nest of that bird is that body of the elder that died at the beginning. And how quickly did we scale this tree, by the way? Is there a shortcut that I didn't know about? Oh wait, maybe back that way? Okay. Let's grab onto that. Oh, I love doing this. Hold on to this. Oh my god, this is so cool being able to do that. Wait, can we use the trees to actually get across to the next spot though? Because that'd be way safer. Yeah, there we go. Let's climb up here and then go this way. You can see the smoke, I guess. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. The impact. You can see which direction it's in. Oh, you know where this is going to be? This is going to be further than we ventured before. I wonder if that was the reason why we couldn't go further. Because we had to do the uh, the objectives. Yeah, inspect a meteorite. So, I guess it was waiting for me to do that. And again, you guys have told me to stick to the trees for the, for the first part of this. Because it's way easier to navigate and obviously a lot safer. So, that's exactly what I'm going to do. And I think this is probably the best way to do it as well. Because we can see everything. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, there's going to be crocodiles in there. 100 million percent. Get over here. Oh, I see it. I see the impact. It's not too far away. Okay, there's the impact over there to the right, but there's stuff. What's that? That doesn't look like a rock. Intelligence. Stand up. Maybe if I go here and then do it. Stand up. Intelligence. What are you... Oh, is it just a new area? The big swamp. So I guess you have to find the landmark areas in order to discover the new areas. Ooh, that's a little bit intimidating. The subtle sounds that they have for this are really, really cool. Birth of a cartographer. Discovered the big swamp as a memorable location. Yeah, I like this area. It's absolutely going to be death, but I like this area. <gasps> Look at that beast! Right, intelligence. Can we not identify what that is? Like, smell. Yeah, there we go. Focus. Identify. Memorize. That is such a big snake. Oh, that's so cool, though. Oh, wait, I see him moving. Look at that. You can see the snake moving down there. Is this its, is this its nest? <gasps> I hear something moving over to my right, but I don't care what it is. Grab an egg. Yes. Go, go, go. Get up a tree. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Up, up, up. Oh, nice. Right, inspect. New food? Are we freaking out because... Is the snake coming back? It's over there. Intimidate? We can intimidate while being up a tree?
Get out of here, giant warhog. Low dopamine. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't go crazy, please. No. Oh, shit. No, no, no. You're panicked. You're losing control. Dopamine is too low. Run to safety before becoming hysterical. Okay. All right, get up there. Come on. Come on. Up, up, up. Gotta get that dopamine back up. Come on. Ooh, that wasn't good. Uh, Yeah, let's just drop that. Well, I thought I found a new food source, but that definitely did not taste good. So... Let's just have something to drink. Don't lick it. Please don't lick the snail. New food. Wait, there's... I can eat this? There's no way that's not going to poison us. There's no way. Does it taste good? Oh. Oh, it tastes really good. Nice. Okay. We're feeling good. We've got... Oh, wait, that had, like, anti-venom properties as well. Or, like... Yeah, what, the toxin, I guess? Like, from the uh, the other eight before. Right, okay, we're going to stay out. Because my dopamine level is crazy good right now because of eating that new food. We're hydrated. We're happy, and we know what we're dealing with now when we go over there. We've got that rock python, and then the meteor crash is just behind it. Like, we're only a stone's throw away, so we're going to go and take a look. Oh... Oh, please tell me that's going to... Oh, yes! Oh, no way. Is it going to wrap it up? Oh, wait. Oh, they... So... Wait, what? So the croc... The crocodile lived through that? Okay, right. You know what? No, no, no. We're getting out of this. I'm not... That's a, a lifeline that I'm going to take. We got the rock python and we got the crocodile now as well. So we, we know <laughs> what's in this area. Can you tell I'm freaking out? <laughs> Can't even speak. Right, climb up there. Come on. Right, well, I've given you my item. Whoa. Yeah, I don't know what that is. If anybody knows why it's doing that, why it does that like weird blinking effect or why it does like the ultra shine on the screen. I'd love to know because I don't think it's really giving me any indication on what that could be. Maybe it's just something to do with needing sleep or something. But yeah, we've officially survived a week with this guy, who I am going to be calling Caesar. You already know. I said that in the previous episode. It's Caesar. Every single one of our apes is now called Caesar. But well, I'm actually really proud of us. We learned a lot with what we can find. We've uh, we've been increasing our brain juice and understanding how things work. Our little friend over here has got a stick. <laughs> He's still got it. But yeah, I think it's time for Caesar to get some rest. Like I said, guys, if you do want more of this... Then once again, please let me know in the comments. Because this is so much fun. It really, really is. If we do want to turn this into a series, I'll only do it if you guys want to see it, obviously. So, yeah, we're just going to lie down. Wait, end expedition? No. I'm just going to lie down. And we're going to have a rest. So, for now, guys, this is where we're going to end it. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your support. And I'll see you all in the next one. Oh, no. We can... I don't... I don't know if Caesar wants to be a dad yet. Oh no! <laughs>